Some people say, guns don't kill people, people kill people. I talked to a guy who recently had a very interesting argument. He said, there's a demon living in this pistol. My thing with the gun, when I shot, I don't know about this demon, but I got high. I mean, your drilling and comes up so high, it's like floating. I mean, shooting behind that gun. Walk, 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 walk. You can't even really, you really don't even realize what you're doing. It's almost as if you smoke some leaf, smoke some PCP or something, just for that split second or whatever, how long you got. Um, you get high, and the more you get high, it becomes an addiction. And that's one of the worst addictions I could have probably ever picked up was the addiction of shooting a gun. Hey! Get assess, holster. Turn to the left, turn to the left. A threat, we're gonna step forward with our left foot. Shooter ready. Ready. Hey, threat. Get assess, holster. Every day I carry a Glock 19, and that gun is actually feels to me like an extension of my body. I carry it regularly, and without it on, I feel naked. It's so comfortable to me to have it on and know that it's there, and I've carried for so long that without it, it just feels uncomfortable. Um, Sometimes, even when I would sit down on the couch next to my husband, he would wrap his arm around me and say, you still have your gun on. And I'm like, I forget that it's there because it's always there. It's there 24 hours a day. Now over top with your hand, just like I showed you. You don't want to put your pinkies near this ejection port because it'll pinch you. Come back here? Yep, and okay. push and pull and let it go. Push what? Push the receiver. Push this? The receiver, the lower part of the gun, and pull the slide. Let it go. Perfect. Okay. All right, now it's loaded. Okay. It's round chambered. Uh-huh. All right, get that hand high on the back strap. Okay. Now, don't try to look for those sights with your head. You're doing that. Okay. Extend your arms out. Bend at the waist. Lock your arms. Bring them in. All right, now bring the gun to your eyes. I believe that the handgun levels the playing field between a five-foot to woman who weighs 115 pounds against a man that's 300 pounds and on drugs of some sort and his intention is to rape or kill or, or maim her and that levels the playing field it gives her that empowerment to know that she can stop him from doing that à retrouver sur spicy et aussi molotov orange et amazon